New at five, there's more to the healing arts than just medicine. Numerous studies show how creative expression through music, writing, or art can break the cycle of chronic pain. At the third annual For Grace Women in Pain Conference, health specialist Denise Dador explains how it works. It feeds your soul and your spirit. For Radine Marie Cook, chronic intense pain from injuries she suffered in a plane crash is a way of life. It means that my pain, uh, there are so many signals and it's at such a severe level that without treatment I would have a heart attack or a stroke. Radine finds some relief in art, poetry and music. There's something about getting inner conflict and inner feelings out to where your eyes can see it. Artistic expression can be more than just a form of therapy. For pain that's difficult to describe, patients can use art to help communicate with their doctor. Some of the pain is indescribable when nerves are involved. It just does bizarre stuff. But I could show them a picture of uh, something being electrocuted and they could understand that. Pain specialist Dr. David Bresler says art can be a distraction from the pain. When they realize that they're becoming obsessed and concentrating way too much on their pain, they need to break that cycle in some way and let their mind focus on other kinds of things. One powerful prescription, focusing on the positive. One of the things that we've learned is whatever you give attention to grows, whether it's your garden, your children, or your worries, anxieties, and fears. And when people pay so much attention to their pain, the pain will grow. It's that advice and art that keeps a smile on Radine's face. I wanted to put on the walls everything that I could look to and grab immediately that told me I was going to make it. It's a reminder to say, yes, I can, and it's going to be okay in the end. In Los Angeles, Denise Dador, ABC7 Eyewitness News.